Keenan, Alicia, there's going to be a lot of drivers that are going to be impacted here with some of these construction projects kicking off this week. What's this closure going to be like for you? It's it's already a pain. 10 Mile Road in Novi just closed this week to through traffic between Meadowbrook and Haggerty. What is 10 Mile like? I like a lot of the roads. <laughs> Bumpy. 10 Mile is undergoing resurfacing and getting a left turn lane. Veronica Singleton just moved to the area. Where are you coming from? I was Canton and it was Canton Center that had to be worked Ooh. on. Yeah, and, and 275? There. Yes. So you can't escape it. I, it seems to follow me. <laughs> I think it's following everyone. <laughs> Also seeing work, Grand River Avenue between Napier and Wixom. A left-hand turn lane is also being added here as well as repaving. The road will stay open throughout construction. However, the intersection at Napier and Grand River will eventually be closed at a date yet to be determined. Now over to Westland. Miramin is now closed. Construction is currently underway here. Has it slowed yes. you down at all so far? Yes, it will slow me down today as I have a dentist appointment. <laughs> Resurfacing of Miramin is happening between Hawthorne and James, with two bridge replacements as well over Hines Drive and Middle Rouge River. Now to Macomb County, where the Innovate Mound project continues this year, one of the largest county projects throughout the Tri area, impacting between 19,000 to 47,000 drivers a day. The Innovate Mound project will not be complete until 2024. Mound has heavy traffic without the construction due to all the factories and plants. When you add the construction to it and the residents, because of the time it takes to, to go through this, it throws everything off. This year, the work is moving south with a focus on rebuilding between 15 Mile and 696, kicking off in March and lasting until November. 23 Mile Road in Macomb Township is also getting a makeover, going from two lanes of traffic to five lanes of traffic. The work started last year and should be complete this November. No matter where the work is, the sentiment remains the same among drivers I spoke to. It needs to get done. Are you happy that some work is finally getting done? Very happy, very happy. It's one of those Michigan things that you have to deal with. The good news with the Innovate Mound project, according to the website, the work is 54% done.